frightened Russians raced to flee the country to dodge Putin's military call, with one-way flights, sold out, and Google searches for how to leave skyrocketing. Desperate Russians are frantically trying to flee the country, after Vladimir Putin announced massive mobilization. In the biggest escalation of the war in Ukraine, since the invasion, Putin clearly raised the specter of a nuclear conflict, and called up 300,000 reservists, in the country's first mobilization, since World War II. One-way flights out of Russia have skyrocketed, and others have been sold out as civilians scramble for tickets to safety. According to Russia's investigative news agency RBK, all airline tickets to visa-free countries have been sold out. Google data earlier showed a family of three would have to shell out £44,000 to get to Johannesburg today on a 45-hour trip with three layoffs. Direct flights from Moscow to Istanbul in Turkey and Yerevan in Armenia both destinations that allow Russians to enter without a visa, were sold out today, according to data from Aviasalis, the buying website Russia's most popular airline tickets. Some routes with stopovers, including those from Moscow to Tbilisi, are also unavailable, while the cheapest flights from the capital to Dubai cost more than 300,000 rubles, 4,500 pounds, about five times more. Times the average monthly salary. By noon, flights to Azerbaijan, Kazakhstan, Uzbekistan and Kyrgyzstan had stopped appearing online amid the scramble. Russian Railways and Aeroflot, the country's top airline, say they have not yet been banned from boarding men aged 18 to 65. The data shows that searches for how to leave Russia were also at the top of Google's traffic at the time Putin's speech was originally planned, when fearful commoners sought to avoid the prospect of conflict. The tyrant's announcement, made in a televised speech early in the morning, raised fears that some men of combat age would not be allowed to leave Russia.